Welcome back guys to another Zero DTE video and today Ernie is going to be talking about the impact of time and volatility on premium curves so make sure you stay tuned. If you're interested in becoming a pro trader check out the link in the description where you can find Ernie's course. Cheers guys. And when we first start, it looks something like this. And then as time goes on, start doing this, and then that. And one thing you may notice about it is that if price is sitting somewhere around here, give that a different color. If price is sitting here or here or here, we're going to be different places on this curve. When it's here, we're going to be right there on that curve. When it's here, we're going to be right here on that curve. And when it's here, we're going to be right here on that curve. That's interesting. If I were to look at the slope of this, the slope of this curve and draw a tangent to it, you can see that this one is not so steep. This one is very steep, and this one's not steep at all. It's flat. Now, if price is moving back and forth, what does it say about that steepness? If that steepness right there is determining where you are on this profit curve, that's determining, well, how valuable is your option? If it's steep, then the sensitivity of the value is going to go up or down faster the steeper this curve is. When it's up here at the top, that value is not going to change very much. But as soon as it gets over to the edge, that value is changing a lot. Now, early on in the day, with a flat curve, the sensitivity is very low. So what that's really saying is that as we get further on into the day, our sensitivity to price movement is going to get higher and higher. That's called gamma risk. On a low volatility day, the gamma risk is kind of preloaded. Remember I said that the strategies seem to be preloaded. They already have a lot of premium in them early in the day on low volatility regimes. So that means that the gamma risk is already present very, very early. And so that means that we need to be more um, nimble on some trades earlier in the day. We are going to take more action early in the day, where if we're in a high volatility regime, we have more time and space to work within. And so the premium curve is starting out low and then it has to grow. So we have more time to deal with that. So all of these things are factors that you adjust yourself to depending on what the volatility regime is, what time of day it is, where you are and when you are in that day. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the like button below. If there's any questions that you might have for Coach Ernie, make sure you leave them in the comment section. Thanks guys.